we, we have uh, changed the way we behave based on the technology we have, but we've also taken, uh, you know, technology and used it in totally unexpected ways. Uh, that's why I think, you know, your point about um, diversity versus homogeneity is really important. And I think one of the, you know, we can look at that at a platform or a device level. Uh, you know, are you going to have, are you going to issue everybody iPhones or everybody Blackberries and that's going to be that? Um, or are you going to have a kind of a bring your own device structure? Um, I think we can look at that the same, same way with usage is that are we going to try to mandate a homogene, homogene, homogeneous usage pattern, right? Or are we going to learn from our workforce who are already using the technology in a really diverse set of ways and map that into organizational goals, right? So that's, so, you know, we look at the consumerization of IT and we say that, you know, now if you want to look at what functions and capabilities are going to be available to the enterprise in 12, 24, 36 months, look at the capabilities that are being baked into the consumer goods now. That, that's, that's great at a feature level. One thing that tells me is that at a, at a for working for a company who's one of our major products is collaborative software, we need to get a lot more visual because, wow, I mean, that's going to be, you know, if I'm looking around at what's hitting the marketplace now, visual features are going to be incredibly important in 24 months. But we should also be looking at the way people are using their technologies and the diverse ways that, that they're using. And that's why I pe think people like, like Genevieve Bell, who's an anthropologist working at Intel, are so absolutely important. Um, and I don't say that just because I'm an anthropologist too, but looking at the way people adapt technology to their own use gives us, if you will, kind of a free ride, a free look at new potential ways to use it ourselves. Right? And, and we're just doing ourselves a huge disservice if we don't stop for a second and go, well, why did you do it that way? Well, because I thought this might be better or I didn't even think about it. It just seemed more logical to me. Try to draw out those lessons from people's diverse usage patterns, right?